supporting YouTube, this is Matt of Doom here. Um, I'm going to be showing you how to get a hidden car in Grand Theft Auto 4, even if you don't have the last um, island unlocked, or any of them unlocked. This is my first demonstration, but I hope you like it. So to begin with, you'll need a car. It can be any car, fast or slow, it does not matter right now. Um, I like to get mine from Brody because it's a free car and it's fast. One of the best cars in the, in the game, so if you haven't checked it out, check it out. Also, I forgot to mention, this demonstration uses no cheats. This could very easily be done with cheats. So if you just want the car, no challenge, no cops, um, just use the cheats. Use the health like every time you're low and the uh, wanted down like every second which will keep the cops away from you and um, you'll be able to get away very easily. So after you get your car, you want to find a helicopter. There are basically two ways to do this without using cheats. One is going to the airport, which you will probably do if you don't have um, the middle island unlocked. And the little um, tourist, I call it the tourist pad, in the center island if you have it unlocked. It doesn't matter which one you use, just get a helicopter and you will need to fly over to a third island. So when you get there, you'll see a lot of helicopters. Just pick one. I like it when he punches the guy. Oh, what now? And if you don't know where this helipad is, here's a little map for you. So it's just basically by the Statue of Liberty, kinda, without crossing the river, of course. So what you want to do now is fly north past the um, Central Park and to the other side of the map. But don't cross over to the third island. It's best if you wait till the last second and then cross it. Because if you cross it, like right before you steal the car, you will have time to actually get into it safely and steal it. Also, when you get to the south part, try to keep your helicopter down and cross it while it's really low to ground so that you have more time to get out and get into the car. And the landing over there is kind of tough, but with, if you don't get it the first time, you'll probably get it the second time. It's nothing amazingly hard. You'll see what I mean in a second. Every second you save by getting a wanted level like a second later, you will have the time to get out of the state faster and safely because the cops will just they don't spawn right exactly at the spot so they will have to come into the state and get you but by crossing it at the last second you will have time to get into the car and possibly get out of the state before they get to you there was also a good example of what not to do when getting out of a helicopter in this situation. You should land closer to the car, maybe not but like right by it, and you should get out only when it stops so that you're sure that you didn't lose any health while doing it. This car is also incredibly weak. 
like it catches on fire pretty quickly if you let it be shot a lot especially in this situation when you have six stars and so I would advise you to keep out of the cops sight because they do shoot out of the car so and also keep your tires protected because if they shoot down a pop of the tire you will probably have to restart because getting on a flat tire somewhere on this car it like skids you so much that you will not be able to get away it's not a problem for like experienced drivers who like play a lot but if you're just starting out just try to keep out of the cops way if you can if you can't well and by the way i don't know if you noticed but when you stole the car the game like spawned a crap load of the same cars like right there see um if there's no cops around and your car is like fucked up you should switch it if you can like and it, it, it will pay off and you will have a brand new car and it will be the same so right here what you want to do is basically turn into the hole right in before you get to it and I actually got pretty lucky here that the car didn't tip over on its back and I actually got through which was pretty amazing and the cops almost killed me but and also in this tunnel you should let through the cops that come straight at you because they will come on the other side of a wall so let them through and then keep on going past the second roadblock the second roadblock is really easy to get through just like pilot around it now here I skipped a little bit to later to show you that having pop tire even one or two in this case could be a really pain in the butt so try to keep your tires protected and find a paint spray after you get through the second roadblock like immediately or try to get away some other way from the car so there you have it thank you for watching and please comment rate and subscribe